Namibia's literacy rate is currently at 91.6%, which is significantly higher than the Southern African average when it comes to the virtual world. However, Namibia does not appear to be doing so well. Only 51% of Namibians have access to the Internet, 31% are active social media users, and the percentage of enterprises with a substantial tech component in their business strategy is significantly lower. Today on One spoke to Ialo Makongo, one of the organizers, to learn more about the Winduk 2021 Digilympics. Digital literacy is the ability for us to be able to use our computers effectively and well. And we have uh, noticed that in Namibia, digital literacy is very low. So we want our students or employees or everyone to utilize the digital world. As we all know that we have COVID-19 that has uh, taken over. So we want, since everything has now taken into the virtual world, we want to encourage and empower people to uh, increase and improve their digital literacy skills. So why we decided to create Digital Olympics is because we want to create awareness and raise um, awareness on the topic of digital competency. We also want to highlight the opportunities that are involved in the digital literacy sphere. According to Magongo, the competition, which aims to improve people's digital literacy skills, will put digital athletes through a speed typing and multiple choice tests in which they will have to exhibit their web and hardware navigation abilities. The digital athletes will do a speed typing test compromising of a 1 minute, 3 minute and 5 minute where they will be tested on their speed and accuracy, followed by a practical test where there will be uh, tested on their knowledge of the work in their hardware skills, and lastly, a multiple choice test. The internet provides huge potential for digital literate users to start their own online business and is a powerful accelerator for social and economic development. The Winduk 2021 Digilympics competition is open to people of any age and educational background and will start at 5 p.m. on the 6th of October at Dololo Dubox, situated on Robert Mugabe Avenue.